That's Ben's thinking face. <laughs> it's the, it's it's the, the same, same as every face. It's the same face. <laughs> it's, it's, it's the grumpy face. It's a thinking face. It's a <laughs> I'm confused face. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's the same face. It's my face. <laughs> Right, today I'm going upstairs to get this OSB down properly. I could flip the camera actually with a, a piece of roof hanging inside the roof of the outbuilding, but that will be moved to put some new stuff on. Now we are going in here morning hang on morning <laughs> morning morning <laughs> yeah two mornings so today is cut the osb down we've read well we had a comment actually about staggering them so we've looked into that and that's what we'll do which is different to what we were going to do we were going to make life difficult for ourselves and go across a full sheet there to cut into these bits because that seemed the strongest option for this area but now we've read and watch some videos on staggering them that will be what we do we just don't know how we're going to do it at the moment to get into the door do we no like that sheet being four foot is just right for going in there it'll only need a tiny bit cut off if anything But then I wonder if that is the place to start over in the door mm. using this wall as the <laughs> yeah and that's what I was going to say there's probably not a straight edge or to square use corner. or a square corner to use for the beginning but it's not going to be our final floor. final floor anyway. So it doesn't matter too much, but it matters enough that we're not going to walk into here every time and go, oh, God, why do we do that? So we need to get it as right as we can get it. Because once this is down, we get to move boxes in here cover the boxes or maybe do this first we've got to take all this off because it is all moldy and then that gives us access to the roof so we can have a proper look at the roof timbers in here and for the electrics it's easier to have the roof exposed for the electrician to come in and do the bits and pieces he's got to do so we've got to do this as well But first, it's the floor. So I'm going to stick it on the tripod. And you can watch us try and decide how we do this. <laughs> it's probably never going to be the right way to do it. But it's the way we're going to do it. We just don't know what that way is yet. No. Where shall I stick it? In a corner? Yeah. Far corner. Oh, it's a lovely big room. That helps. Getting the cables out of the way. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lovely big room. Would you like to see the view out the window as well? We've 
got sellotape on the windows at the moment because the glass has dropped down, leaving where you can see this patch. Where's my finger? Where's my finger? Where does it go? Well, where's your finger There go? it is. See this bit here? That's a nice bit of Gorilla tape, keeping out the breeze. It's a shame this window's not the cleanest one on the outside to see outside and disregard the messy sheds. It looks quite nice out there. And then we got this one out here. Now that's a view. You thinking? Yeah. That's Ben's thinking face. <laughs> it's the, it's it's the, the same, same as every face. It's the same face. <laughs> it's, it's, it's the grumpy face. It's a thinking face. It's a <laughs> I'm confused face. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's the same face. It's my face. <laughs> right, so here we go. I've got my microphone on that I put in a washing machine the other day. We thought it was dead but it appears to have come back to life. I don't know if it just dried out. So we're hoping, it's showing me that it's recording on the transmitter, so hopefully it is. Oh, um, right, I'm going to pause at a moment.
one sheet, done. That's not bad for 30 minutes. <laughs> Is it? No. <laughs> Just 30 minutes? Yeah, of course it was. Dawn's face will I tell mean, you. I think it might have been about 45. Yeah, mm, you look yeah. at Dawn's face long enough. If you look at the camera, <laughs> yeah. and now you tell us how many minutes it was again. 45? 45. Yeah? yeah? Are you sure? No. 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 Might have been three hours and four. I don't even know what the time is. <laughs> no, I don't. Um, oh yeah, it was. Probably three hours. <laughs> <laughs> three hours. <laughs> Which is why when I said if there are any floor fitters, we are really, really sorry. <laughs> um, right, you see, I'll turn this round. Oh, that's close. <laughs> right, let's put that there and there for me and me. Hello. I'll come and join you. Above shots, like that. Above shots? Above shots, there we go. <laughs> so we got one in, which yes. is... Yeah, it's a start. Um, the next, really, we've got four tricky ones, maybe. Maybe one tricky yeah, one and two this, around a half. This, yeah. Um, the rest should go down straight forward. So, yeah, we'll stick the camera in the corner um, and we'll just time lapse it, I expect. Yeah, because. You could be this, here all this, night. Yeah. You could be having to take some days off of work to finish the video. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. Right, so that's what we'll do. We'll check you in the corner um, and we'll stick on a time lapse. Yes. And with some funky music. Mm, yeah. Enjoy. Okay, yeah. thanks for that. Carrying on with the flooring again. Um, I'm going to flip this quick. I want to show you this bit. This we can actually just step, step into on. the room. From moving in here, we've always stepped into here like this because even when the floorboards are in the way, they're all a bit rotten. So you couldn't stand there, safe in the knowledge that you wouldn't end up in the kitchen. So to be able to walk into here is amazing. 
I've still got a few bits to do today. Um, we worked up until about 10, half 10 last night. Um, and I had to pack up because we were tired. <laughs> we, we don't have a staying power of um, another channel that we watch, West Court Wanda. They did some concreting, so he was building a well house and did some concrete, concrete foundation for the well house. Well after midnight, still doing it. We don't have that kind of staying power. No, we went to bed. We went to bed by about half 10, 11. Um, I'll stick a link to his channel actually in the description, or Ben will, I say I will, Ben will, Ben does the filming. Uh, ben does the editing, I do most of the filming and most of the chatting because <laughs> I do like a good ramble. Um, yeah, I'll stick a, we'll stick a link in to the description. That's a good channel. He's in Ireland, obviously, with the name. It suggests where he comes from, West Cork. And he's doing, or they're doing, it's him and his wife. And they're doing um, pretty much what we're doing with a bit more demolition than we've managed to get around to at the moment. But it's the same kind of thing. It's the rooms upstairs that all need doing with the panelling and the petitions coming down. But yeah, definitely. He's a good watch. He is a good watch, definitely. And he's funny. He is funny. <laughs> <laughs> he makes us laugh every time we watch him. He says something, he's, he's yeah, he just comes out with some classics. I love it. Um, and his wife, what was she doing? She's been doing the piggery. Digging out all the stones. Yeah. A bit like when we did the cow shed, except for the roof next to their piggery is supposed to be coming down. Ours wasn't. No. But it did at speed. And then yesterday, the gazebo didn't do very well either. No. But Ben filmed that too, so. Yeah, so... I won't say anything else about that. Because here it is. That is what it is. Right, so we've got this little patch here. It does have a panel on it, but it didn't cut very well last night, so we've got to do that again. We've got this delightful conundrum. All sorts of different angles to cut out of the one sheet there, so that will be fun to watch. <laughs> <laughs> for you. It won't be fun for us got this piece well we got two full sheets here but obviously you can see it doesn't reach so we're gonna sort how how we're gonna do that we're gonna have a gap at the back we're gonna have to infill that we ummed and ahed about where we we knew that the sheets didn't go fully across the room that we wasn't sorry 100% sure of where to put them, the, the gap. But I think that's where we've landed on. So we've got this sheet, that sheet, but we've got to try and do this corner here, which, like I said, won't be as bad as that corner because there's only the two angles to cut. But we need a big enough sheet for the strength, so we don't want to just leave a tiny little bit. So we've got to decide how we're going to cut these two bits there but I will flick you around stand you on the stand because you're better off on the stand rather than me me filming and swooshing it around and making everyone dizzy so you can watch Ben sweep instead <coughs> right there we go what we starting first couple more screws in there yeah we got I've cut some pieces downstairs to double up on some of the joists because the OSB doesn't land right all of the time does it for no, we'd end up joists. with two feet two foot sheets if we were to try and get every edge of joist 
yeah. cover, um, halfway with the OSB. So we've cut some extra pieces of joist to go below the OSB as extra support. Most of them, or all of them, are on a joist, aren't they? It's just... Yeah, just the edge. Just the, the edge. So we're going to build it up to support the edges. Rain in. Fancy that. Hmm. Let me show you the view out here. It was too dark last night to. It was dark, dark. Look at how picturesque that looks. I don't know if you can hear the rain, really. <clears throat> oh, postman's outside. Oh. Can see his van. Oh, I'm nearly tripping over. Right, they're looking out the window at the moment. Okay. I'm looking out the window. Where should we put you? If you try over here. How's that? Comfortable.
straight walls but the stones obviously are not uniform like bricks so you'll have some that poke out some that sit back but that's in and screwed down and then we got this one that you're doing now is that for the corner the corner for the where the half is and then we got the t these bits over the on the edges of the wall there and then this floor will be done so that's good 